Do you know how to get a loan in cryptocurrency? With the advent of DeFi, the rules of the financial system are changing. I'm Eva and in this video I'll explain how DeFi will soon shut down all banks, making credit card obsolete. I'll break down the components of the financial system of the future and why it's time for you to start understanding it. DeFi or decentralized finance is a true revolution. Picture a system where your money works for you, not for banks, where every action is transparent and you have full control over your funds. Sounds fantastic? Let's dive into how it works and why DFI is changing the game in the financial world. What is DFI? DFI is a financial system without intermediaries. There are no banks or other institutions controlling your money. Instead, you manage your funds yourself through specialized blockchain applications. Want to take out a loan, make a deposit or exchange currency? In the DFI world, all of this is possible directly without unnecessary middlemen. You interact with other system participants using smart contracts and decentralized applications. Now let's take a closer look under the hood of DFI and examine its five main components. First, blockchain, the foundation of DFI. Picture a massive digital ledger spread across thousands of computers worldwide. That's a blockchain, the bedrock of DFI. Every transaction gets recorded and each computer or node keeps its own copy. What's the big deal? These nodes are constantly checking each other. Try to mess with one record and the others will catch you red-handed. It's like having thousands of eagle-eyed accountants watching every penny. Talk about security. The blockchain stores info in link blocks, forming a chain. Each block doesn't just hold the transactions, it also points the previous block. This makes nearly impossible to alter old records. It's like trying to change history. Good luck with that! This setup ensures DFI is transparent and trustworthy. Every transaction is out in the open and ready for everyone to verify. Second, smart contracts – the heart of DFI. Now meet smart contracts – the real game-changers of DFI. Imagine a contract that enforces itself – no human needed. Cool, right? Let's say you want a loan. In DFI, you'd use a smart contract, provide some crypto as collateral, and boom! The funds automatically land in your account. No one can mess with the process or change the rules mid-game. Smart contracts kick middlemen to the crop making everything faster and cheaper. Plus, all terms are clear from the get-go and set in stone. No fine print surprises here. Third, decentralized apps, the interface of DFI. Meet the apps, the rable apps of the financial world. These blockchain-based programs are like regular apps on steroids. Why? They can't be shut down or messed with by any single entity. The whole network got their back. Think of a cryptocurrency exchange app. In the old-school world, it's tied to one central server. But the apps, they're free spirits. All transactions happen directly between users through the blockchain. No middleman, no fuss. What's in it for you? Total control over your data and cash. Plus, these bad boys are nearly unhackable. Try taking down thousands of computers at once. Not gonna happen. Now, what makes this D apps T? Digital assets called tokens. Stick around, I'll split the beans on how to snag a token loan at the end of this video. Force tokens the digital gold of DFI. Tokens aren't just some numbers on your screen, they're the real deal in DFI. Think of them as digital Swiss army knives. They can represent anything – cold hard cash, hot stocks, even voting rights in decentralized organizations. What can't you do with tokens? Use them to shop, invest in the next big thing or have a say in how platforms are run. They're born on blockchains like Ethereum and zip between users faster than you can say transaction complete. But here's the kicker. Tokens can be as unpredictable as a roller coaster. Their value can skyrocket or nosedive in the blink of an eye. That's where their chill cousins, stablecoins, come into play. 
but more on that in a sec. Fifth, stable coins that come in the crypto storm. Enter stable coins, the then masters of the crypto world. While other cryptocurrencies are on a wild roller coaster ride, stable coins keep their cool. How do they pull it off? They're tied to real world assets like the dollar, euro, or even gold. Want to dip your toes in crypto without the vertigo? Stable coins are your life jackets. Picture this. You're about to buy something with crypto, but in the time it takes you to click purchase, the price goes bonkers. With stable coins, that ancient history, their value is as steady as a rock. These steady edges are the secret sauce of DFI. They let you stash your cash and make transactions without worrying about sudden price free falls. Hungry for more stable coin knowledge? We've got a whole video on it. Check out the link in the description. Now, doesn't all this sound like banking 2.0? Smart contracts that are set in stone, a system where you are your own banker. It's like DFI is throwing the gauntlet to the traditional financial system. But can DFI really knock out the old school banks? Let's set up a showdown between the financial heavyweights. Round 1. Governance and control. In the blue corner we have the traditional system. Banks, financial institutions and governments call the shots here. They decide who gets a loan and who doesn't. Want to change the rules? Good luck with that. Picture this. You need a loan. But the bank says, no. Or they suddenly jack up your account fees. What can you do? Not much, except maybe switching banks. Now in the red corner, DFI is bouncing on its toes, ready to rumble. Here, you're the boss of your own money. No central authority calling the shots. All rules are backed into smart contracts and apps, and nobody can change them solo. Need a loan? No need to grovel at the bank. Just hop up onto a DFI platform and strike a deal directly with another user. Freedom of choice and total control. That's DFI's secret weapon in this round. So, who's ahead? DFI is showing off some impressive moves with its flexibility and freedom. But don't count out the traditional system just yet. It's still packing a punch with its stability and regulation. Score after round 1? It's tie. DFI 1. Traditional system 1. But folks, this financial fight is just warming up. Round 2. Security and risks. The traditional system steps back into the blue corner. It's bodyguards, banks and financial institutions. They're keeping your data and cash locked up on their services. Sounds safe, right? But hold up. What if hackers crash the party or the bank goes belly up during a crisis? Your hard on cash could vanish in a puff of smoke. Now let's see what DFI's got in the red corner. Here the blockchain itself is your bodyguard. Every transaction is out in the open and locked tight. Your data isn't sitting in one place, it's spread across the whole network. Even if one part gets hacked, the rest keeps on ticking. Plus, you're in charge of your own money. Sounds like an account, right? Well, not quite. DFI's got its own weak spots. Bugs in smart contracts or code vulnerabilities could be a gold mine for scammers. Who's winning in this round? Both fighters are showing some fancy footwork. The traditional system is reliable but could get floored by a big hit. DFI's got some slick new moves but you've got to stay on your toes. Score after round 2. Another tie. DFI 2. Traditional System 2. Round 3. Accessibility of financial services. The traditional system lumbers into the ring, buried under mountain of paperwork. Want to open an account? Prepare for an avalanche of forms and checks. Living in the boonies without fancy banks? Tough luck, Paul. But wait, here comes DFI, bursting onto the scene with a battle cry, finance for all. No red tape, no documents dodge. 
Got internet? Boom, you're in. Loans, investments, currency swaps, all at your fingerprints. Chilling in the remote village or prefer to keep things down low? DFI's got your back. Who's taking this round? DFI lands a knockout punch, spinning open the doors of finance to millions worldwide. Score after round three. DFI surge ahead. DFI 3 – Traditional System 2 DFI is pulling away, but hold on to your heads, folks! This financial face-off isn't over yet. Let's see DFI is flexing its muscles in the real world. DFI in action – two game changers. Check out these two DFI heavy hitters already shaking up in financial theme. 1. Decentralized exchanges Taxes are the new cool kids on the block letting you swap cryptos without a middleman. Here's the lowdown. Swap cryptos directly without smart contracts. Keep your funds in your own pocket. No sketchy third parties. Blockchain does all the heavy lifting automatically. 2. Lending platforms DFI lending platforms are telling traditional banks to take a hike. Here's how it rolls. Offer up some crypto as collateral and get a loan in return. Interest rates, supply and demand call the shots. Everything is locked in a smart contract, no take-backs. These platforms are a double threat, borrow or earn by lending your crypto. But heads up! Always read the fine prints and know the risks. To wrap it up, DFI is a game-changer with the potential to flip the financial world on its head. But like any shiny new toy, it comes with its own set of risks. Approach with caution and make sure you know what you're diving into. If this video got your brain buzzing, smash that like button and subscribe. We've got tons more mind-blowing content coming on your way.